And welcome back to Sporky News Podcast. This is Scott, and we have some news on the House of Dragon, which is the prequel series on HBO to A Game of Thrones, take place 300 years prior, uh, talking about the Targaryen dynasty and how it started with Aegon and his sisters. Uh, we found out yesterday there was an article on Deadline talking to President of Programming, Casey somebody, starts with a B, I can't look at it because I'm recording on my phone, but uh, they're talking about a 2022 uh, series start on HBO, so we have some time. I was really hoping it would come out next year, but wow, they're on pace, I guess, for 2022. So we'll see what happens. Uh, there are four other shows that are indefinitely on hold. I'm guessing they're going to see what happens with this. Uh, Martin did... Uh, sign a deal that they were going to put five in the works after Game of Thrones, but then they had that um, long night prequel they were working on that took place 8,000 years before the story that was so woke, even HBO didn't want to play it. After Watchmen, can you imagine HBO didn't want a woke show? That is crazy. But, um, so that's the news. Uh, you can go to Deadline and check out that article, but House of Dragons 2022 premiere. Let's keep an eye on this because I am... I'm excited. I was talking to the guys last night on the fourth wave with Nerd Rotic. You can watch that on my channel, so just scroll down from this video. Um, and I'm excited to see what they're going to do with it. I really am looking forward to it. I'm hoping with George helping with the penning and Spinach, Spinachik, Spinachik, you know how to say his name, uh, the great director on Game of Thrones for some of the best episodes, uh, definitely some of the best episodes, uh, definitely the best battles. Um, is, you know, show running. So we're hoping it's going to be a good one. But tell me what you think. 2022, will your interest still be peaked? Or is that way too long off? And sorry about all the lighting. I'm in my car, of course, because I have no time to do it in my dad's corner. So everybody, if they're uh, calling you names, they've already lost the war. Have a great day, everybody.